Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this lecture, we will discuss about distillation of inhexane, inheptane, and inoctane in a distillation column using the DWSM software. So, uh, the problem is a mixture with 33% inhexane, 37% inheptane, and 30% inoctane is to be distilled to give distillate product of 0.01 mole percent of inheptane and bottom product with 0.01 mole percent of n-hexane. The column is operating at 1.2 atmospheric pressure. Reflux ratio of the column is 2.4 and with 60% vaporized feed. Assume molar flow rate of the feed is 100 kmol per hour. Calculate the uh, distillate and bottom composition, the distillate and bottom product composition. Uh, calculate the minimum and actual number of stages, calculate the minimum reflux ratio, calculate the optimal feed stage and plot the temperature, pressure and composition profile using DWSM software. So first of all we will open DW, DWSM software, uh, click on create new. So click next to continue click on next and here uh, select the component so there are three compounds n-hexane, n-heptane and n-octane n-hexane this is n-hexane, n-heptane and n-octane these are three are selected click on next and use a uh, pro uh, property package so I am using the Ken Robinson equation of state uh, cl uh, click on add and click on next uh, select the system of unit you can use any system of unit. I am using C5 and click on next. Click on finish and here go to the column and select uh, the shortcut distillation. Drag and drop this one. Double click to increase its size. This one. This is feed. This is the top product. This is the condenser energy. This is the reboiler energy and this is the bottom product. This is the reboiler. This is the condenser. This is the distillation column. Click on the feed. So this is the top product, this is the condenser duty, this is the reboiler duty, and this is the bottom product and this is the distillation column, ok, this is the feed, ok, this is feed, select on the feed, material stream number 1 and rename it, so this is feed and this feed consists of click on the compound this is the input and the input go to the compound amount and click on it so the feed consists of mole fraction so it consists of it is in mole fraction you can change it to mass fraction so in the question it is in mole fraction so it consists of 33 mole percent in hexane 33 percent in hexane 33 percent in hexane 33% in hexane, 37% uh, in heptane, 37% in heptane, and the remaining is in octane, which is 30%. 30% is in octane. The sum of mole fraction is 1. Okay. Click on accept changes. It is okay. Now it go to the feed, and here the feed is uh, 100 kilomole per hour. It is given in the question that the feed is at 100, the feed molar flow rate is 100 kmol per hour, it is 100 kmol per, uh, it is 100 mole per hour, 100 mole per hour, so uh, the feed is 100 mole per hour, 100 mole per hour, 100 mole per hour, mole per hour, okay, now the pressure of the column is, it is given, that the pressure of the column is uh, it is at 1.2 atmospheric pressure and 60% vaporized so 1.2 atmospheric pressure so we will go to the uh, uh, go to the pressure and vapor fraction so we have information about vapor fraction so pressure is 1.2 atmospheric pressure 1.2 atm and the vapor fraction is 60% is vaporized the feed is 60% vaporized uh, it is 60% vaporized so 0.6 60% vaporized it is ok now go to the column 
and here you select this is the column name so first I'm changing station column installation column and here this is the field it is connected this is this stream number two is distilled so I will change it to the distiller and this is the condenser energy it is QC condenser duty the reboiler duty is QR, QR and the bottom is the this is the bottom bottom ok now click on the distillation column and this is the feed top and bottom product condenser and reboiler energy now the light key component so as we know that the question in the question the light key component is the light key component is uh, uh, n hexane and the heavy key component is n heptane and the non heavy key component is n octane non heavy key component that is the uh, heavy non key component so the n octane is non uh, non uh, uh, heavy non key component so the, the the light key component is n hexane and the uh, heavy key component is n uh, heptane n heptane so so in the question it is uh, the uh, 0.01 mole 0.01 mole fraction of n heptane uh, is in the uh, in the top and the bottom product consists of 0.01 mole fraction of n hexane so the n hexane is the light key component the light key component uh, the light key component so n hexane is the, the light key component and n heptane the heavy key component select the heavy key component so it is n heptane and non heavy key component is n octane so we have no information about it so the light key component in the bottom light key component in the bottom the n hexane is in the bottom is 0.01 mole fraction it is okay the heavy key component which is the n heptane is in the top is it is 0.01 mole fraction so 1% of n 1% uh, uh, of the hexane is in the bottom and 1% uh, heptane is in the top mm, so it is the total condenser ok the condenser pressure this is 1 bar by default it is 1 and it is also 1 uh, bar it is ok now uh, click on solve button uh, the reflex ratio information is also given to us so here you can it is ok it is ok so there is no information about reflex ratio in this column so we will delete the information about this one we will calculate the reflex ratio so there is no information about the reflex ratio in this column so there is no information about the reflex ratio so it is ok now click on the solve button we will calculate the reflex ratio so it is solved now here you can check go to the bottom side and here the minimum reflex ratio is this one minimum reflex ratio is this one and minimum number of stages is 11 minimum number of stages is 11 and this, uh, this is the condenser duty is uh, 0.66 kilowatt and the reboiler duty is uh, 0. 0.09 kilowatt is the reboiler uh, duty uh, it is ok now the minimum reflex ratio is this one this is the minimum reflex ratio ok this is the minimum reflex ratio ok now at this the, it is given the reflex ratio is 2.4 it was 2.4 reflex ratio is 2.4 in the question there is information about the reflex ratio the reflex ratio is 2.4 so at this 1.5 reflex ratio we will get these number but at 2.4 reflex ratio what will be the answer so it's 2.4 reflex ratio click on solve So minimum number of stages is 11 and the condenser and revolver duty is changed. Minimum, uh, so this is the reflex ratio. 
So now in order to get the uh, uh, minimum number of stages, we will increase the reflex ratio. Suppose I am changing it to uh, 3.2. So now when the reflex ratio is increased, so what will be the minimum number of stages? It will be 11. It is 11 and the actual number of stages is this one and this is the optimal field stage is this one so at this now if the reflex ratio is decreased 3 so the actual number of stages will be increased though it is now that I am changing it to 3.8 so the number of stages is a decrease now I am changing the reflex ratio further increase it 4 so now the actual number of stages is 20, 21, 3.8, 22, I am changing further to 4.8. So the, this is the actual number of stages, actual number of stages is, actual number of stages is 18. Now the actual number of stages is 18. Now I am changing the reflex ratio to Suppose I am changing it to 5. So the this is the 19 number of stages. I am changing further 5.2. So this is the 17. 17. Now I am further changing it to 4.4. 4. So actual number of stages is 17. And uh, so at 5.4 reflex ratio, if I am increases at high reflex ratio the number of stages will be decreases and this is the optimal fuel stage 7 and the condenser and reboiler uh, duty this is the condenser duty this is the reboiler duty and the bottom composition so and the question that uh, it shows that what will be the bottom and top composition calculate the distillate and bottom composition so the bottom go to the distillate and go to the compound amount so this is the composition here the distillate in the distillate in hexane is in the distillate in hexane is uh, 99 percent about 99 percent and in heptane is this one and in octane is about zero now go to the bottom here go to the bottom and this is the bottom and in the bottom the in hexane is a uh, 0.01 and the uh, uh, in heptane is 0 0.54 uh, and 0 0.4 4 is uh, the in octane so uh, now go to that uh, you can uh, check the so this is the now go to the results this is the mole fraction uh, this is the imitation the dynamic okay this is the dynamic imitation results so this is the input data okay the stream condition okay now the stream condition the results okay this is uh, this is the connection okay go to the setting you can uh, also plot the uh, uh, the, the um, property table so go to this setting and here so sorry this is close this one uh, go to this one is the uh, this is the setting and go to the tools so here this is the insert so master property table you can insert the master property table you can insert the charts so this was all about the mm, uh, so this was all about the uh, with how can we obtain the top and bottom uh, product composition using the dwsm software thank you very much for your attention